Hey guys, it's Raquel with Stage Right Secrets, and I am here with Michael Tyler. What's going on? How are you? I'm great. This is awesome. How are you doing? I'm. It's great. It's CMA Fest, so we're strolling <laughs> along oh, as yeah. a little bit. All right, so have you been super crazy busy? Steady? Uh, not, not super busy, but yeah, steady would be a good word for it, I think. That's good. All right, I heard you did the CMT block party. Yeah, was, How was that? It was awesome. Um, they got to like put it on a commercial and everything, and I was kind of like on TV and stuff. You know, so I, was, I mean, street cred now. You, know, you, you were on a commercial. I was on TV. So <laughs> the last time I interviewed you was right before your record, debut record, had come out, 317. Yeah. That's kind of crazy. And now it's we're in June, and it's out. So good. Such a good record. Congratulations. Yeah. So now I can actually ask you about it, because before you couldn't really tell me much. <laughs> so how did we pick the track listing? Because I feel like you have a pretty steady, like, set of ballads and upbeat and like everything you kind of need yeah well i mean i have a secret weapon named michael knox mm. um who produces jason ld and picks all the songs for his record and stuff so the songs i would write he was just like this is what it's got to be and then of course i was like all right, i want to put this one song right here to make me feel like i did something and uh we called it good awesome and you were touring with low cash oh yeah how was that I mean, they're they're always fun. Such a party. Yeah. What did you, what was one thing you really took away from that tour? I think just motivation. They motivated me a lot after seeing them, you know, do their thing every day and how much they were just out there and killing it. You know, mm -hmm. they were just happy all the time. They always tried to make you smile no matter what. So, so now you're gonna be happy all the time, 24/7. Yeah, I'm gonna try. <laughs> smile and yeah. nod. That's all you gotta do. That was my New Year's resolution. Oh, be happier. Perfect. All right. So you have been putting out. A ton of a good amount of covers on Instagram of songs you like. Slow Hands is my jam. <laughs> Digged that one. What are you listening to right now? Everything. I, I don't know. I just listen to everything. Of course, I listen to country radio 24/7. But you know, I get on my Apple Music and the, the pop station. I kind of listen to just about everything. Yeah. All right. Well, if if you're gonna create a playlist, who are you gonna put on it right now? Who am I gonna put on it? Mm -hmm. Hmm. So I can go listen to it later. Okay. Um, I would put obviously Keith Urban. Carrie Underwood, Jason Aldean, Sam Hunt would have to be in there, some Harry Styles, yes. some Nile, uh, let's see, this new band, uh, what's it called, they have a song called Old School, I can't remember the name. I'll have to look it up after. Yeah, it's awesome, I just, I just heard of it, so, so don't hate me. Yeah, okay, but, <laughs> all right, all right. But yeah. yeah, okay, so I'm going to have to go, we're going to have to go listen to all that stuff later. All right, so because it is CMA Fest. Oh. Urban Cone. Sorry, I just remembered. Urban Cone. It came, light bulb. <laughs> it happened. I was like, wait, what? Oh, okay. We got it now. Check that out later. All right, so because it is CMA Fest, mm -hmm. and I'm just going to say, if you could have a fan club party that had endless amounts of money, okay. didn't have to worry about money, what would you do? What would I do? Yeah. What kind, of, what kind of fan club, club party would you have? Um, unlimited amount of money. Mm -hmm. Like, it'd probably be like in a helicopter. Okay. <laughs> Above the city, a big helicopter, obviously, for like 10 people. I mean, you'd all have to, obviously, you'd have to have like the big headphones so you could hear each other talking. Okay. Yeah, it'd be okay. something like that. Yeah. Who would perform besides you? I don't know. I mean, you have endless amounts of money. Me. Yeah, just me. <laughs> just you? All right. I mean, that's true. It's your fan, fan club party, so right. why not? Why not do it? All right, so Festival Starter Pack. Five things you need to have at a music festival. Um, water, mm -hmm. for one. Uh, gotta have my Funyuns. All right. Just because. Um, <laughs> what are you laughing at? Everybody I wasn't said, expecting oh, that. I wasn't expecting that at all. I was like, hey, okay. Asked, but then asked. I was like, you're right. They're really okay, good. So I got water and Funyuns so far. Um, I mean, what else do you have at a festival? I don't know. I don't, I don't go hang out at festivals. Like, I normally... Well, maybe you should. Yeah, maybe I should, probably. I was, I'm from a town of 2,000 people. We didn't have festivals. But you're in them now. You're performing yes, at them. So yeah. what do you need at festivals? What do I need? Yeah, I sure, we'll go with that. Much. I don't need that much. Just water and Funyuns. Yeah, I'm all right, cool. All right, guys, that's all we need at festivals for our starter pack. Like, no sunscreen or water. No, right. I don't do sunscreen either. That's why you're Dan. All right, well, <laughs> now we know. Now we got this. All right, well, what is coming up next for you? Uh, we're playing a lot of shows this summer. Doing a lot of shows in the summer and the fall and just promoting the album and all that stuff. So we're going to be all over the place. Yeah. New music. I'm Are we starting festivals so with maybe, my Funyuns and my get, water? Maybe I get more educated on what I need to bring. I feel like I need to give you like a festival, like, Probably. like Probably. what do what we need to do Probably. thing. Probably maybe that'll be our next segment. All right. Well, we cannot wait to see you everywhere this summer. Check out his music. Where can everyone find you on social media? So actually, if you just go to themichaeltyler.com 
It has everything. It has the Instagram, Michael Tyler Music, Twitter, Michael Tyler 93, Facebook, all that stuff. Easy enough. All right, guys, and to stay updated with all things music, be sure to check out Stage Fright Secrets and all of our corresponding social media, and uh, check you next time. Bye.